Cheetahs, nature's ultimate speedsters. They can go from zero to 60 in three seconds, faster than a Lamborghini. Flat out, they can hit 71 miles an hour. So, how does the world's fastest land animal run so fast? There are just 7,100 cheetahs left in the wild. And Namibia in southern Africa has more than any other country on Earth. The Nan Kuse Wildlife Sanctuary is home to several orphaned cheetahs. Among them are Athena, Bolt and Bullet. These awesome animal athletes are all under the watchful eye of their human mom, Colette Massia. These guys are very sweet. I mean, the hand-raised cheetahs, so they cannot be released, and they're just far too used to humans. And because of their loving upbringing, they're just out really to have fun. Hey, yes, you are. To demonstrate how these fun-loving felines are the fastest animals on land, Colette has come up with the ultimate high-speed challenge. A lure will simulate a runaway prey, zipping across a 500-foot-long course at over 50 miles per hour. It has sharp 90-degree turns that mimic the prey's evasive maneuvers. Now we're getting to that lovely dusky hour. It's cooling down. There's a bit of a nice cool breeze in the summer heat. So now's an ideal time to get them chasing and to see how they do it. Time to find out if these cheetahs are the real deal. A high-speed hunt in the wild is usually over in less than 30 seconds. It's the same here. Accelerating at an incredible 29 feet per second, these felines are frighteningly fast. I like to call them the Lamborghinis of the bushveld because they are super fast, super fast hunters. I think it's amazing. Everything about a cheetah is designed for speed. This is animal engineering at its finest. Supporting their muscular, streamlined body is one of the most flexible spines of any cat. Its vertebrae connections are incredibly loose, enabling it to flex inwards, bunching the legs together before exploding out into a huge hyperextension. This spectacular spine means that with every stride, a cheetah can cover up to 22 feet, reaching 40 miles an hour in just three strides. And even super tight corners are no match for this speedster. In the real world, those antelope are stupid. They are going to zigzag and cut corners and do all sorts of things, trying to get away from the cat. And so the cheetah, at this high mass of speed, has to also zigzag and keep going, you know, because they're focused on that animal completely. It's absolutely incredible. It really is. Magic. Sharp, semi-retractable claws grip the ground like running spikes. And a two-and-a-half-foot-long tail makes crucial balance adjustments as the cat tears after the zigzagging prey. It really is the rudder that keeps them going, because if they're going flat out and really fast after prey in the wild, without the tail, they would most likely fall over at that speed. They wouldn't stand a chance. And there's one more trick up this speedster's spotty sleeve. When a cheetah runs, its head barely moves. The head is straight, fixated, focused as they would be in a hunt. It's like a missile on a target. They're just completely on it the whole time. Scientists have recently discovered how a cheetah's head is able to remain virtually in the same position while the rest of its body is in overdrive. It's because of their ears. They have the longest inner ear canals of any cat. The liquid-filled canals are lined with tiny sensory hairs. As the cheetah runs, the hairs measure its body movement through the movement of the liquid. This information is sent to the brain, which uses it to keep the cheetah's head under perfect control, like a gyroscope. These extra-long ear canals are super sensitive and enable the cheetah to keep its head totally focused on the prey. You don't get to be the fastest animal on land without the perfect physique. And when it comes to speed and agility, cheetahs truly are a cat above. <laughs>